Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Remastered. I'm Kamchak Fisco, and come join me for the zombie survival adventure. The hell? These papers lie scattered about, they all seem to contain articles about stars. Okay, so this goes around. It's locked. Door plate reads gallery. So this just goes around to the other half of where it was. This should be a map. Map of the residences. Holy, this place is huge. I think we want to go back in this room, because whatever that shit is, it's, it's standalone. So I was right the first time of thinking that. It's a giant beehive. Well, we shouldn't have looked through the room. Well, that was a mistake. Cherry? Alright. My favorite flavor anyway. Should probably get some moisture in my mouth first so it's not dry as a bone. <laughs> now that I think about it. That'd be very bad to just do... You always close like at least one eye. Mm. It's fine. I love it. It tastes great. It actually does. Mm. Don't inhale it. Mm. That was stupid. Okay. Most of the sour's gone. It's tolerable now. Don't get me wrong, they're actually really good, Dap. If you want something to reward your audience with, like for donation markers or anything, Lag and I have been using these for a while, and it fits. I mean, it really does. It's, it, it's, it's enjoyable candy, a little on the sour side, but still good. A little on the sour side, the most sour candy you can find on the planet. But, well, as far as I'm aware of. But it is good candy, it actually is. And I love sour stuff, so it works perfectly for me. Nope, not look, examine. <laughs> you have no possible idea what power you toy with! Damn it, Dapper! Thank you for the gift you'd so. Valiant, enjoy your how are you not a okay, I guess you weren't subbed. Damn it, Dapper. How dare you? Thank you, I appreciate it though. Look with a red cover. Nothing is printed in any of the pages. Is there a special way to use this? I guess. First aid spray. Mix of green and blue herb was inside. Huh. Never seen that before. Interesting. We still have one more space, so I'm going to check upstairs. Nice ass. Um, did our case, it's empty. Another win for the Urkin <laughs> army. Hi, Lag. How you doing? Startled the crap out of me. Two, three, four, five, six. Is this like color based or what? Doesn't seem to be any significance about it. Order, but. Are these all the ones I have to light? Hmm. Welcome in, Raiders. How y'all doing? Obviously, I need to light this. Alright, so we have blue, green, red. Or no. Blue, red, orange. So. That's definitely orange. So we need purple, blue, green, red as the other colors. Purple, blue, green, red. It was blue and red, right? Green, so we need purple, blue, red. Yeah, I, I know you were here earlier, Dark. You've been lurking the whole time. That's red. So where's purple and blue? Huh. So 
So we need purple and blue. I need to actually go swap some and heal a little bit. So it's a good thing there's a storage room right here. That would have been nice to know before we started backtracking so long. <clears throat> That's the map. That's the inventory. So we've got a red book that we can't read. The only thing I think of is maybe the colors correspond to the ball numbers, and that's a combination. So we've got what? Red, green, and orange. So that'd be red, green, and orange. Five, six, and three. I've forgotten like a majority of the puzzles, so I'm just like blindly fumbling through trying to solve them. This better be not, not be the house where we fight specimen number 42, because I have no ammo. Oh, right, and we let the bees out. Shit. Look, that door was locked. All right, hopefully I didn't miss any of the doors back there, because that room sucks. No, we didn't. This goes down. Well, we got a document. Point 42 report. God damn it. Four days have passed since the accident. The planet Point 42 is growing at an amazing rate. Although there's many unknown aspects about this planet, we know that in comparison with the other group of plants, the T-virus has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. T-virus has drastically morphed its host an anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. No on Earth will you find anything like it. We also found that Plant 42 is two main sources of acquiring necessary nutrients. One source is through its roots. Somehow it has rooted itself down in the basement. Whoops. Yeah. Immediately after the incident, accident, a scientist went mad and destroyed the aqua ring. Ever since, the basement has been a pool. There's a high possibility that one of the chemicals in the, in the water is promoting Plant 42's rapid growth. Okay, ever since the basement has been like a pool, there's a high possibility... Okay, yeah, we read that. However, we've yet to determine the specific chemical. The bulb-like body of Plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling of the first floor. We are sure that it uses the air ducts to reach the first floor. Uh, numerous long tentacle-like vines are protruding from the bulb. <laughs> Oh, yeah, one day I'll speak English again. <clears throat> we believe the vines are a second means of acquiring its nutrients. Uh, when the Plant 42 senses its prey, it uses tentacle-like vines to capture its prey. After doing so, the suckers of the vine, uh, yeah, the vine drain the prey of its blood. We've also noticed some intelligence. When it captures its prey or it's inactive, the vines uh, twine around the door to stop possible intruders. Unfortunately, several of the scientists have already fallen victim to Plant 42. We've heard stories from the survivors. They are all observed one thing in common. When the uniform petal-like flaps open and reveal its vital organs, there's a tendency to become more aggressive. One witness the report that says it was as if it was trying to protect itself. Why it behaves the way it does is still unknown. May 21st, 1998, Henry Sarton. Okay. Old newspapers, magazines on top of the bed. Somebody appears to have vomited blood on top of the newspapers. Lovely! You're obviously not dead. Get, get back up. Dead yet? I have two shotgun shells. I can't kill Plant 42 with two shotgun shells. Okay, these can be moved, but, like... How... I'm trying to remember how to move these. Do I move this one back and then that one over? Or did I just do this backwards? I think I may have done this backwards. Oh wait, no, that's how we get down. If we can get down to the basement, we can actually kill it with the, the, the plant poison. Aqua Ring. Oh, it is where we fight the shark. Okay, before we go doing that, can I, like, finish exploring the house first? Alright, what's in the bathroom? Tell me there's bullets in the bathroom, because I'm out of ammo. I might actually have to just, like, end the stream early just to do this. So I can go back and replay and have supplies. It's crazy. Can I not click on any of the... 
Got the residence key that'll let us open the other two doors. Okay, I guess that's it. So we should be able to go unlock the other two doors. Which I want to go do that now. Uh, hopefully one of these isn't the uh, the plant monster dude, because that would suck hardcore. Get off me. Okay, that says the gallery, so that won't open that one. I gotta go over here. Wrong door! Wrong door! Wrong door! Damn it! Grief. Can I get through the bloody... Thank you. Well, if I have to reload this, at least I know not to look through the damn hole next time once we get the map. Honestly, I may not even grab the map, just to make sure they can't come out. I think I want to have the box there and just go over on this side because he always grabs me on the way back out. But then again, it might grab me going the other way. I don't know. I don't know if there's a right or wrong way. And I just went the wrong direction. The key's behind me. Or not the key, the lock. The words! Use the residence key. No further use. Get rid of it. Yes. Hopefully this isn't where Plant 42 is, or I'm boned. Why do you sound like another safer? Um, excuse me, I need to get by. Thank, thank you. Showing signs of use. Self-defense gun. Suicide note. July 22nd, 1998. I had to do it. We ran from those things, helping each other survive, but Robert started to show some symptoms. I had to do it. Those damn things are pure evil. There was no other way. He would have done the same if it were the other way around. But I, after I put him out of his misery, I had to just leave him in the bathroom. Now I'm probably the last one. How could this happen? I'll never forgive myself for being part of the project. Eventually, I'll, have to, I'll get what's coming to me. There's no way to escape this nut house. It'll just be a matter of time. Everything is set. All I need is a little courage to get it done. Knowing that I will be that I'll leave many things undone is a regret beyond words. But this is better than just waiting to turn into one of them. Please understand at least let my ends let me end my life as a person. There's a message on the back. Linda, please forgive me. Finally got a freaking clamp. Well, bookcase, blah 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 blah. Pistol bullets, about freaking time. Might be too little too late, but it's still something. And his friend's probably gonna be a zombie in the bathroom. So get ready to shoot immediately. Oh, I probably could have done the whole Light them on fire thing. I didn't even think about that. Well polished mirror. <clears throat> Full of dirty water. Pull out the plug. Yes. There's something inside the bathtub. There always is. Can't carry anymore. Oh, that's the the freaking which call it key. Alright, we've got a little bit of ammo, but not a whole lot. Our shotgun's almost dry, so there's no point in keeping it on us anyway. Okay, so swap that for the handguns. We're gonna freaking need it. I actually kinda wanna burn that body just in case. Self-defense gun we'll put away for now. Still don't even know what the hell we do with the book yet. No, we'll, we'll take this. We'll take this. Alright, back into fine. Back to the pistol. See if we can do some freaking good with this. I'm going to try lighting him on fire, and then we'll go pick up the key that we left behind that we're going to need, probably in the underground facility. I don't know if we can light the hanging guy on fire, but I might try that as well. Perfect. Now he can't come to life when we grab the key. 
love how giant the key looks in the tub, but it's like this big. It's it's not that big of a key. All right, I wonder if we can light the hanging guy on fire. Let's find out. I don't trust him not to drop off and kill us. Okay, maybe not. He just gets to hang there all, you know, gruesome and macabre. It's fine. Now, for normal playthroughs, I will actually, or like, you know, if I were, you know, playing this not far on... I mean, honestly, I should be saving a hell of a lot more often, but we've screwed up so badly that, you know, at this point, it's better for me to have to start over just to have more ammo, so... It's fine. Consequences are appropriate for the punishment. All right, we gotta get past all these assholes. And I'm assuming they'll just keep spawning, so it's pointless to try. I never actually did test to see the beasts don't come out if you don't look, because if that's the case, then just don't look. Like, seriously. Time to descend into hell. Don't own it, never played it. And from what I hear about the audience, it's not a good one to stream, because people get vitrolic as fuck. This is a lot of movable boxes. This screams puzzle. Drop this one in, move that one over, drop it in, then move the next one over and drop it in. Yeah, so that one's fine. I don't need to be like at a fancy angle for that. Perfect. So we have to deal with Plant 42, Jaws, and the spiders all roughly the same time. That's that's very friendly. It's just it's the animal kingdom represented. All right, let's go get the last box. Then we can actually check the door. All right, that should actually be locked in and that shouldn't change even if I step away. Let's see what we need for this door. It's locked from the other side, so it doesn't matter. We had to solve this puzzle. Good to know. And we're going into shark-infested waters. It'll be great. Nobody has a fear of sharks, right? Richard! Yeah, you're gonna get eaten. Chris! We saved you from that snake. Richard. Get to it, hi. Try to freaking just. I can't exactly see these assholes. Damn it. Get off me. Freaking hell. And I put my health away like an idiot. That was that was a great plan. Well, get rid of the key. Why, why didn't I bring health with me? Why? Well, I mean, on the way out, they, they drown, so, because we you'll raise the water level. Well, that indicates there's an emergency. You don't say. I never would have guessed. Till the long ladder. My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoy it. You all take care of yourselves. If you want to see more of me, come to the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below, and please remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.